Hey guys, I coded the script to do non-planar infill in Prusa Slicer. This hopefully improves the strength in the set direction. It is implemented as sine wave pattern which fades in and out to avoid issues with the bottom and top layers. It also accounts for slopes. And it works with all infill patterns. But I wouldn't try it with curved ones like for example Gyroid, because it consists of way too many points to process and would take a really really long time. You can control the frequency and the amplitude of the wave with two parameters. Minus frequency followed by a number and minus amplitude followed by a number. You can go crazy with this. Just have in mind that your nozzle can collide with stuff. Or you can do just a very slight deform. Let's look at how to install. For that you need to have python installed which you can download from python.org. Then open a command window and type where python and copy that path. Download my script from the github which is also linked in the description. Now in Prusa Slicer go to print settings and then output options and add your path to python in quotation marks. After that add the path to the script in quotation marks too. Now you need to add minus frequency followed by your desired frequency and minus amplitude followed by your desired amplitude. If you now slice something and then save it, it will run the script. You can inspect the processed G-code afterwards by dragging it into the slicer again. This will be implemented with the bricklayer post-processing script with the goal to make the prints even stronger. An update on that is planned for the end of the week. I also got in touch with Stefan from CNC Kitchen and he kindly agreed to make some tests with my scripts, so stay tuned for that too. You can report bugs on github or my subreddit linked in the description. If you want to support me you can write a comment and leave a like. But now have fun with the script. Thank you and goodbye.